Hi everyone, welcome back to 365 Ninja. I've got a quick tip for you today in Outlook. You can see here that I have a new email open and if you need to insert a table into your email to display your message or your data in that kind of format, it's really easy to do. Go to the Insert tab and make sure that you have your cursor clicked. You, you select somewhere in the body text of your email and then you see these icons kind of light up here and you can click the table icon. Now the menu here is a little less sophisticated than what you might see in say Word, but you can simply select how many rows and columns you'd like to add, let's say five by seven. Click that and then once you've inserted your table, you get the design tab. So from here you can add shading or you know even change font style, that kind of thing. So I'm just gonna add a different background in my header. You also have some quick table styles that you can choose from if you'd rather do that. And then you can go ahead filling in your data. Now in the Outlook web app, you have a similar kind of insertion point. So with your cursor selected into the body of the email, you'll click the down arrow here and then you can find this table icon. Now you get an insert table, but you can see that the all you really have is this table drawing grid. You don't actually have any formatting options. I mean, you do have a style here, but that's about all you got. So if you do need to create a really intricately designed table style-wise, you'll probably want to do it in Outlook 2013. Hope that tip helped. For more tips and tricks like this one in Outlook, please visit 365ninja.com. Thanks.